When visiting a trade show, most folk are after free tote bags and pencils, but not me. I swerved that one and made me way straight to the fluke stand, because I'm more interested about this. It's the 1674. Let's take a look at it. You're on site, juggling leads, jotting down results in a dusty notebook, only to realise later you've missed one or the numbers don't make sense. So you retest, double handle everything, then spend your evening turning it into a cert. It's long winded, easy to get wrong, and it's burning time. In this video, we'll take you through the key features of the Fluke 1674 FC, including this handy trick where you can tap any test point on screen and run the test straight from there. Let's get into it. Now, if you're comparing models, here's how they stack up. The 1672 is a great entry point it covers all the core tests you'd expect insulation resistance continuity loop impedance short circuit current and rcd testing including ramp tests and s type rcds the 1673 fc adds bluetooth and support for fluke connect that's fluke's bluetooth based system for wirelessly syncing test results to a phone or laptop using their app plus auto test sequences and ev charger testing with rdcdd the dc sensitive test required for many installations if you want the full suite of advanced tests, the 1674 FC is the one to go for. It adds high resolution loop testing measuring impedances down to 0.001, supports insulation monitoring device IMD, testing for IT earthing systems, not information technology, but installations with no direct earth reference commonly used in hospitals and industrial environments like chemical plants. The tester simulates a fault and checks whether the insulation monitoring device picks it up properly, ensuring the alarm would trigger if something ever went wrong and when it comes to SPD that surge protection device testing the 1674 checks whether a surge protective device has silently failed the performance of SPDs can degrade if they are subjected to a number of surges from nearby lightning strikes or power line disturbances the tester identifies if the SPD needs replacing saving you from relying on visual indicators or guesswork you also get insulation pretest which checks for any connected loads before running the insulation resistance test helping you avoid damaging equipment or getting false readings and of course you can create custom auto sequences for different test routines it's fluke's top spec unit in this range let's kick off with something that'll genuinely speed up your testing auto test just one press and it runs the full suite if auto starts enabled it kicks in as soon as the leads detect mains no fiddling no button presses. With auto test, it'll cycle through continuity, insulation resistance, polarity, loop impedance, and RCD test all in one go. That's five separate tests bundled together. No change in settings, no lead swapping, no faff. It means fewer mistakes, less time on each circuit, and a clear pass fail right on screen. If you've got the tester magnet mounted to a board and the screen's upside down, no worries. Just flip the display 180 degrees. Keeps everything readable and saves your neck. You can build your own custom auto test sequences too set the test order add pauses and save it i've set up two of my own one for dead testing and one for live so depending on where i am in the job i just pick up the set and go it's ideal for phased installs where you're testing part of an installation while other areas are still being worked on or when you're sticking to a familiar workflow all models in the range let you build out circuit structures directly on the unit or through flukes true test software it means you can name circuits distribution boards and even test points right from the tester true test handles the project setup and data management side so when you're back for an EICR or retest you just reload the project if anything's changed you can update it on site using the on-screen keyboard it's ideal for repeat work like rental properties or new builds saves rework cuts down admin and keeps everything consistent right let's break down what it actually does on site you've got continuity with a 10 milliamper option that's ideal for delicate work like checking control circuits or sensitive electronic components where a standard test current might trigger devices or give unstable readings insulation resistance up to 1000 volts and full loop and line impedance prospective fault current and voltage drop are built in too during loop tests the tester also also gives you an interference level gauge this can explain those unexpected readings in some cases especially in noisy environments where harmonics or background electrical noise could affect accuracy RCD testing covers every base with 14 selectable types and 6 milliamp RDC DD for electric vehicle installations it's all built in and selectable from the test menu that flexibility means you can match the test exactly to the type of RCD installed with confidence you're getting the right results and if you ever need a quick reminder how to connect up your leads to perform a test 
or you're not sure what a test is asking for, just tap the I button. The tester brings up clear on-screen guidance specific to that function. No manual needed, but if you really want one, a full version can be downloaded. Before we get into how it handles data, here's what you actually get. The 1674 FC comes in Fluke's classic rugged yellow carry case with all the usual gear, test leads, crocodile clips, USB-C cable, and one lead even has a built-in test button. And compared to all the Fluke testers, like the 1650 and 1660 series, the case has had a full redesign Design, it's much more rugged with better internal layout and protection. A small thing, but if you're throwing this in and out of the van every day, it matters. Now on to connectivity. Fluke Connect handles the sync. Wireless, no dongles needed. You've got Bluetooth for syncing test results to the Fluke Connect app on both iOS and Android. The USB-C port is used for charging and data transfer to a Windows PC using TrueTest software, but at the moment it doesn't support Mac. Just a heads up, if you're charging, it locks out testing. That's a deliberate safety feature, unplugged to continue. On a full charge, the tester will comfortably last a full day's work around 10 hours, and it gives you a red battery warning when you've got less than an hour left. True Test is Fluke's desktop software for managing your test data, organizing jobs, building certificates, and keeping everything compliant. Fluke also regularly releases firmware updates to keep the tester aligned with new regulations and standards, helping keep your workflow future-proof as compliance evolves. It's designed to save you time by turning raw test results into fully traceable reports. All your data is waiting for you when you open it on your Windows laptop. You can build your test structure from the tester or in software, board, circuit, test point and here's the absolute killer feature for me you get the full distribution board layout right there on screen in a format we're all familiar with. Each circuit and test point is clearly shown just like you'd see on a cert. And if you want to test something specific, just tap the field and hit the test button. It jumps straight in. That's ideal when you're snagging or revisiting circuits later. It takes you straight to the test you need. Certificates, built and ready in minutes. Your branding, correct regs like BS, 7671 and everything ready for export or client handover. It's a huge time saver and takes the stress out of admin at the end of the job. Board tested, cert signed and emailed before you've even packed up your leads. The Fluke 1674 FC isn't just a tester. With True Test and Fluke Connect, it's a complete workflow. It saves time, keeps you accurate and gets you out the door quicker. Whether you're doing a single cert or a full building rewire, this thing keeps up. Honestly, it's like having a tidy apprentice, does what you ask, logs every test and never forgets a result. Let me know what you think of this tester. If you're an existing Fluke user, does this Fluke 1674 FC model have features that would make you trade up from your current tester and if you're new to fluke which version would you go for i'll leave a link in the description so you can explore the range further or drop a comment if there's anything you'd like clarified but if you want to know how i produced a minor work certificate using this check out the link on screen